click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, I welcome you all to this video. We are with the chapter of digital image processing where the restoration of the image techniques we are dealing with. We started this chapter with the knowledge of image degradation model. So we expect for these techniques that the original image is affected with certain kind of degradation like the blur effect or it is added with certain kind of the noise. Various kinds of the noise and its corresponding parameters also we have addressed so far. And for the restoration, we have gone through the learnings like the mean filtering, order statistic filtering, the adaptive type of the filtering and in the previous video that we have covered band reject type of the filtering here. So let us now address the band pass filters that are the dual swap band reject filters. So here we start with our topic as in the previous video we have addressed the band reject type of the filterings here for the band pass filter we have a complete opposite operation to that of the band reject filters therefore whatever the transfer function with respect to such type of the filtering can be there it has been obtained from the previous one by making a difference like we have the band pass filter hbp of u comma v computed as 1 minus h suffix br for the band reject filter for the two parameters into the frequency domain u comma v here so now while performing the straight band pass filtering there is a kind of drawback so it is not a common procedure to opt directly the band pass filtering onto the image whereas the previous equation where we have utilized the band reject filtering and subtracting it from the one that may be one of the option so that we have minimum losses while working with the band pass filtering here however the band pass filtering if you do is quite useful in the isolation of the effect onto the image of the selected frequency bands there so here for band pass filters we have the example also in the previous lecture we have addressed this image this is the image that has been affected because of the periodic type of the noise throughout this image you can see a similar kind of the noise pattern that is with respect to the number of rows and number of columns here so while we apply the band pass type of the filtering as just now we have discussed a point that we can have the isolation of the selective frequency patterns here so this is the extracted frequency periodic type of noise here by application of the band pass filtering so this way we can achieve the image restoration with the help of band pass filters here so here this is actually the representation by taking the inverse Fourier transform onto the product top the Fourier transform of the degraded image so it is represented here capital G of u comma v here into here we have h suffix bp or u comma v that is the filter function with respect to the band pass filters here so i hope band pass filtering is very much clear to you people by the next lecture we continue with the same chapter image restoration addressing the topic notch filters i hope you enjoy digital image processing subject the concepts we share and the knowledge we prove with the help of matlab programming along with a practice of several numerical problems for more information and the details of the subject, you can subscribe to Ikeda channel. Thank you.